So this is our music system of this hybrid car. In every car you will find this kind of music or entertainment system. In this car we have got this button. This has nothing to do with music system. This is hazard lights. When you turn it on, all four indicators will be turned on. And so now I will explain you this music system. Right now it is showing this time right now. What is the time in Brisbane? So right now it is around 3 p.m. And uh, these are all these buttons are for music system like this is FM and AM. Like if you want to switch between FM and AM, you can turn this button on. So right now FM is on. If you want to go to AM or uh, you can just press this. So just keep on pressing this button and then it will switch between FM, AM, etc. If you want to turn off, click on this. And there are various other buttons over there. So these buttons are actually used to switch between channels. Like in FM, there are, could be different channels. So you can switch among different different channels like that. To increase or decrease the volume, you can use this knob. Like that you can increase or decrease. So this is the used for the CD. You can insert the CD and then uh, music from the CD will be played. This is used to switch between channels. One, two, three, four. You can see this is changing. Five, six, like that. So then in the FM, same thing. FM1, FM2, like that. It is also showing the frequency as well. Then the SIG buttons are actually used with the USB. If you want to play the songs from the USB, you can see here. There is the USB plug over here. So you can just insert your USB drive there and then you can play the songs from that USB drive as well. Then this is actually shows the mode of the driving like right now it is in parking state this car is in parking state P means parking state Then next is R R means when you are reversing the car that will be turned on N means neutral D means drive when you are driving your car It will be in the D state and the S means sport mode and in the sport mode Your car will take very good pickup like more power will be utilized then this is rpm details over there it will show how many uh, rpm are happening then this is very simple fuel indicator right now you can see that half capacity of the half fuel capacity is there and this car has got 40 liters of capacity so at a time you can like you can uh, have 40 liters in your car car tank on the left hand side this is actually is showing like what is happening in your hybrid car so this is indicator is used mainly for the hybrid car like right now it is at the middle when it is in the green zone that means uh, that battery of the car is being charged and when this indicator is in this blue color that means your battery is assisting in providing power to the car this is the speedometer it will display like at what speed you are driving your car there is a auto button over there so when you turn this auto what happens is that your car will automatically choose the air conditioning settings for you you don't have to increase or decrease the fan you don't have to choose the mode you can see that automatically it is it has increased this fan speed so if you want to reduce it you can do it manually and then right now it is in the manual mode but you can also do it automatically as well by pressing this button now let us say you want to increase or decrease the temperature how you can do that so this button is there you can see that this blue color means that cold this red button means hot so right now you can see that yellow is displayed yellow means low temperature is there so if you want to high increase the temperature you can see that right now it is 19 20 21 like that you can increase if you want to decrease just rotate this knob like that in anti-clockwise or clockwise direction and uh, there are different different uh, modes for the AC so right now it is in this mode that means the air in the car is recirculating air from the outside of the car is not uh, coming into the car the air that is right now in inside the car is recirculating if you want to get the fresh air outside of the car you can press this that means fresh air is coming into the car normally most of people will prefer this thing this is normally used to only increase uh, like make the car colder this button so normally I will recommend that you keep it in this particular thing then this thing is used to remove the 
frost or the fog from the windscreen again this this is a rear that means if you want to remove the fog or the frost from the rear window then this particular button can be used if you want to turn it off you can turn off like this so with the help of this button you can increase or decrease the fan speed and this is the mode like you can see that right now air is coming through these vents these are called as vents you can see that there are various vents through which the air flow is coming so right now it is coming on the face this symbol you can see if you want to change that air flow you can you can uh, press this button and now you can see that it is coming to your foot as well air is flowing in two directions so if i press this again right now the air is coming to the foot only not on the face so that's how this mode button is used to like change the direction of air